lesson, we're going to talk about uh, building one's drum vocabulary, uh, what I like to call it. Um, and in this case, I'm going to take a rhythm, and I'm going to play it three different ways on the cymbal, but the bass and snare are going to stay the same. And then I'm also going to put some um, rudiments in the, some of the breaks, um, and just some good exercises where you can kind of expand on um, what you know. So basically, um, the first beat, and again, in all these, the bass and the snare are going to stay the same. It's simple um, quarter notes on the bell, and it's a triplet count. So the first snare hit is, is a softer hit. Like a ghost note. Okay, and then I'm going to add the hi hat quarter notes. I took that faster. Okay, so keeping the same bass and snare pattern. I'm going to change the right hand to like a shuffle feel. And that's slow. Let me do it without the hi hat. With the hi hat. Pick that up. Finally, um, I'm going to do like a swing pattern on the right hand. Slow, and that would be like this. If I added the hi hat. Okay, now I've got two breaks. One is um, a lot easier than the other one. So again, what we're what I'm trying to do here is just build uh, drum vocabulary. Um, the first one we start with a six-stroke roll. One, two, and then on the um, the second part, I do. Uh, half of it is a, a Swiss Army triplet. A Swiss Army triplet would be like a right flam, right, right, left. And I do the um, the first hit on the small tom. So the second half, I just do two flams together, followed by the bass. Right hands on the floor tom, left hands on the snare. Three. Last part, I end with the left hand on the small time. So if I put that together, that measure. So let me do the two measures of the break. Put the hi hat with that. put the first beat along with the break and I'm going to do uh, the beat two measures and then go into the break and the break is two measures. Now let me do it with the uh, the shuffle.
finally, let me do it with the swing. Okay, this is for the advanced players out there. Um, the second break, I do two different speeds of the six stroke row. I start off like I did before with eighth note triplets, but then I go twice as fast to get into sixteenth note triplets. So if I did that real slow, it would be one da 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 If I went a little bit faster, add the hi hat with that. Then the second uh, part is going to be eighth note triplets. It's going to be one, If I put the two measures together, By playing the hi-hat, it's kind of like a metronome. It keeps everything together so you know if you're going too slow or too fast. So let me put that with the, uh, the beat. I'll do quarter notes first. Shuffle to it. And then finally, we do the swing. Okay, then once you get it um, with all the patterns, it's, it's kind of fun to just combine all of them. 